So I prototyped a mount for my Flip 32 10 Degrees of Freedom and my Neo 6 GPS. I like to prototype things up in Google SketchUp before I actually build them because then I find little inconsistencies that will come back and haunt you when you try to build it. Like right here, the screw holes would be too close together and you wouldn't be able to screw them together. This is a copy of the Flip 32. I took my calipers and measured everything. Like these things here I found in the warehouse. Um, all these chips I made this little it's called an S3B plug I made from scratch in Google SketchUp. These little LEDs were uh, found on the warehouse and I just changed the color from blue, uh, red, and green. This is a replica of the connector on the GPS unit that I made from scratch. S3B connector that I made. This one was a two pin one but I extended it and made it a three pin one and mounted on here and uh, see how everything is going to fit. But what I want to do is mount a piece of plexiglass on top of a 10 millimeter hex uh, nylon standoff and I'll have five millimeter hex standoffs on the bottom that I can mount onto uh, the frame. This is the Creus Neo 6 that I made from scratch in Google SketchUp. It's the exact size and uh, like the chip is the same thickness and this is the same exact connector that I have on the real GPS unit. So I prototyped this up to see how everything would fit, how, if there were going to be any problems with the pins or anything like that. Also, see if there were any clearance issues on the GPS unit. So, by rotating my GPS unit 45 degrees, I can drill holes um, that are away from each other so that it'll fit. So I've printed this out on a piece of paper in a one-to-one -one scale. I sprayed a little bit of this on the back of the paper and then affixed it to the plexiglass. Now I'll uh, cut it out with a Dremel and a diamond cutoff wheel. So I have this cut out and now I'll uh, drill the holes in it for the mounting screws. So now I've got the holes drilled in it and I can remove this paper and the plastic backing. So here's a finished product, the Flip 32 mounted on the bottom and the GPS mounted on the top. I don't know how much interference the GPS will get from the Naze 32, but um, I don't think it should get too much because the signal comes down from the top. I will mount a piece of foam over the barometer to prevent any wind from causing uh, altitude changes. I'll probably take the uh, top off of my Q-Brain ESC and drill four M3 holes into it and get some uh, countersunk metal screws and mount it that way so this can sit on top of the ESC so it's all kind of one unit. One thing that I discovered while uh, cleaning the spray-on adhesive off this plastic glass is if you use rubbing alcohol on it, it cracks it. It will cause the edges to... Um, have little running brakes in it, which I did not know until now.